Ghana has a vision to spur social and economic growth and is embarking on a series of ambitious mega-infrastructure projects aimed at enhancing productivity across diverse sectors of the economy. These projects, ranging from transportation and energy to healthcare and education, represent a concerted effort to modernize infrastructure and stimulate development nationwide. While some are nearing completion, others are still in the planning stages, reflecting Ghana's commitment to long-term strategic planning and sustainable growth. In this video, we explore the 10 most impressive mega-projects underway in Ghana, each with its own unique significance and potential to catalyze progress. From the construction of new highways and railways to the expansion of ports and airports, these projects promise to revolutionize transportation networks, facilitate trade, and unlock new economic opportunities. Additionally, investments in healthcare infrastructure, such as the construction of hospitals and medical facilities, underscore Ghana's commitment to improving public health outcomes and enhancing access to quality health care services. Similarly, initiatives to bolster education infrastructure aim to empower future generations with the knowledge and skills needed to drive innovation and prosperity. 10. The Akratema Motorway Project For the first time after 58 years, the Akratema Motorway is seeing major innovation works. It heralds a significant milestone in Ghana's infrastructure development efforts, spearheaded by the Ghana Highway Authority. This ambitious initiative encompasses the reconstruction and enhancement of the Akrataima Motorway, along with sections of the N1, N2, and N6 highways, representing a comprehensive endeavor to improve transportation networks within the region. At the heart of the project lies the construction of a 29.7-kilometer highway that will serve as a vital link between Ghana's capital, Accra and its neighboring industrial hub, Tema. Once completed, this newly revitalized corridor promises to revolutionize travel between these key economic centers, offering commuters a safer, smoother, and more efficient journey. Prior to the project's initiation, the motorway had deteriorated significantly, earning a reputation as a perilous route fraught with hazards. However, with the advent of the Accra Tema motorway project, Travelers can look forward to a vastly improved roadway that not only enhances connectivity, but also prioritizes safety and convenience. Beyond its immediate impact on transportation, the project holds broader implications for regional development and economic growth. By facilitating easier access between Accra and Tema, two crucial nodes in Ghana's economic landscape, the motorway project is poised to stimulate trade, commerce, and industrial activity thereby fueling socio-economic advancement. I think it's a good idea. If they can do three and complete it, it's better than they having an ambition to finish doing five and they couldn't finish it. Nine, the Petronia City Project stands as a visionary endeavor poised to transform the landscape of the western region of Ghana. Situated just eight kilometers from Takarati, this expansive development spans 2,000 acres and represents a meticulously planned city aimed at becoming the premier integrated hub for the oil, gas, mining, and education industries in West Africa. Led by Wonderworld Estates and Petronia City Development Affiliates, this ambitious project seeks to address the pressing infrastructure gap in the region, which has become increasingly pronounced following the discovery of oil in 2007. The subsequent surge in social and economic activity underscored the need for comprehensive development to support the burgeoning industries and capitalize on the region's newfound potential. The Petronia City Project is not merely a collection of buildings, but a carefully orchestrated urban environment designed to foster innovation, collaboration, and sustainable growth. With state-of-the-art facilities, modern infrastructure, and strategic location, it aims to attract businesses, investors, and professionals from across the globe, positioning the western region of Ghana as a hub of excellence and opportunity in key sectors driving the region's economy. As construction progresses and the vision of Petronia City takes shape, it serves as a testament to Ghana's aspirations for progress and prosperity. It's a revolutionary industrialization and is taking over the world by surprise. Eight, the Tima Port Expansion Project it represents a pivotal milestone in the strategic blueprint of the Ghana Ports and Harbors Authority, aimed at solidifying the port's status as a central maritime hub in West Africa. Recognizing the critical role of Tima Port in facilitating trade and fostering economic growth,
This expansion initiative is integral to enhancing the port's efficiency, capacity, and competitiveness on the global stage. The project is unfolding in multiple phases, with the successful completion of the first phase laying the groundwork for subsequent enhancements. Recently, the commencement of the second phase was inaugurated by President Nana Akufo Addo, signaling the government's unwavering commitment to bolstering Ghana's maritime infrastructure. Spearheaded by Meridian Port Services Limited, a leading player in port operations and management, the expansion project aims to modernize and optimize Tima Port's facilities to meet the growing demands of regional and international trade. At its core, the Tima Port expansion project seeks to address key infrastructure challenges and capacity constraints, thereby improving operational efficiency and facilitating smoother cargo handling processes. By investing in state-of-the-art equipment, dredging activities, and terminal infrastructure upgrades, the project aims to streamline logistics, reduce turnaround times, and enhance the overall customer experience for port users. Furthermore, the expansion initiative is poised to stimulate economic activity, create employment opportunities, and attract investment, thereby driving socioeconomic development in the surrounding communities and the nation at large. As construction progresses and the vision of a modernized Tama port takes shape, Ghana reaffirms its commitment to advancing maritime commerce and strengthening its position as a key player in the global trade arena. 7. The Ghana International Trade Fair Center Reconstruction Project is now set to become a profitable and well-resourced institution. It marks a significant stride towards modernizing the nation's trade exhibition infrastructure. With the government's approval of a comprehensive master plan, the project aims to transform the Trade Fair Center into a cutting-edge hub for commerce, exhibitions, and conventions, aligning with Ghana's vision for economic growth and development. Already underway, the reconstruction project is slated for completion within the next three to five years, signaling a commitment to timely execution and delivery. Upon its conclusion, the revamped Trade Fair Center will emerge as an ultra-modern mixed-use commercial estate equipped with state-of-the-art facilities designed to meet the diverse needs of businesses and visitors alike. The reimagined Trade Fair Center will feature a myriad of amenities, including exhibition and convention spaces, offices, shopping malls, leisure centers, trade villages, cultural parks, hotels, and amusement facilities. This comprehensive array of offerings aims to create a vibrant and dynamic environment conducive to fostering trade, networking, and economic activity on both domestic and international scales. As the project progresses, it is poised to enhance Ghana's reputation as a premier destination for trade and investment, while also providing a platform for showcasing the nation's cultural heritage and entrepreneurial spirit. 6. The Ghana National Cathedral Project It represents a significant architectural and cultural endeavor symbolizing the nation's deep-rooted Christian heritage and commitment to spiritual expression. Planned as an interdenominational Christian cathedral, the National Cathedral is poised to become a prominent landmark in Accra, Ghana's capital city, marking the country's 60th anniversary with a testament to faith and unity. Commissioned by President Nana Akufo Addo himself, the project stems from a promise made during the 2016 general election embodying a commitment to national identity and religious pluralism. The cathedral's design reflects grandeur and reverence, with plans for an auditorium capable of accommodating 5,000 worshippers, alongside spaces for contemplation and reflection such as the countryside chapel and the baptistry. Beyond its role as a place of worship, the National Cathedral site will serve as a hub for artistic and educational endeavors, housing a music school to foster talent and appreciation for sacred music, an art gallery showcasing Ghanaian and Christian artistry, and a museum dedicated to the Bible, providing insight into the nation's religious and cultural heritage. As construction progresses, the Ghana National Cathedral Project stands as a testament to the nation's aspirations for spiritual renewal, cultural preservation, and social cohesion. 5. The Apollonia City Project, situated approximately 20 kilometers from Accra, stands as a testament to Ghana's commitment to modern urban development and inclusive growth. Spanning an impressive 2,325 acres, 
This ambitious endeavor represents a mixed-use and mixed-income urban development initiative aimed at addressing the growing housing needs of the region and fostering vibrant communities. At the heart of the Apollonia City Project lies a vision to create a sustainable and inclusive living environment capable of accommodating approximately 100,000 residents, as well as catering to the needs of an estimated 30,000 daily visitors. The project's comprehensive approach encompasses a diverse range of amenities and facilities, including residential complexes, commercial spaces, retail outlets, and light industrial zones, all strategically integrated to promote convenience, accessibility, and quality of life for residents and visitors alike. Upon completion, Apollonia City will emerge as a dynamic urban center, offering a harmonious blend of residential tranquility and commercial vibrancy. The carefully curated mix of housing options and amenities is designed to cater to a wide spectrum of income levels, ensuring that the benefits of urban development are accessible to all segments of society. Moreover, with its emphasis on sustainability, innovation, and community engagement, the project sets a precedent for future urban development initiatives in Ghana and beyond. As construction progresses and the vision of Apollonia City takes shape, it serves as a beacon of progress and possibility, embodying Ghana's aspirations for inclusive growth, economic prosperity, and vibrant urban living. 4. The Accra Marine Drive Project It emerges as a transformative initiative aimed at reimagining the waterfront landscape of Accra, Ghana's vibrant capital city. Spearheaded by the Ministry of Tourism, Arts and Culture, this ambitious development scheme encompasses a sprawling 241-acre expanse along the city's coastline, presenting a unique opportunity to redefine Accra's urban identity and elevate its status as a global tourism destination. At its core, the Accra Marine Drive project aligns with the vision to cultivate an iconic skyline that will position Accra among the ranks of world-class tourism enclaves. Through meticulous urban planning and architectural innovation, the project seeks to create a dynamic waterfront precinct that seamlessly integrates cultural, recreational, and commercial elements. From luxury hotels and upscale retail outlets to entertainment venues and waterfront promenades, every aspect of the development is designed to enhance the visitor experience and showcase Ghana's rich cultural heritage and natural beauty. Moreover, beyond its role as a tourist attraction, the Accra Marine Drive project holds immense potential to catalyze economic growth and development. By providing essential infrastructure to support Ghana's burgeoning cultural and creative industries, the project creates a conducive environment for artistic expression, entrepreneurship, and innovation to flourish. From art galleries and performance spaces to artisan workshops and culinary establishments, the waterfront precinct promises to become a vibrant hub of cultural exchange and creative vitality. As the Accra Marine Drive project progresses, it symbolizes Ghana's unwavering commitment to harnessing the transformative power of tourism and cultural heritage for sustainable development. 3. The Tema Mpakadan Railway Project It represents a crucial step towards enhancing transportation infrastructure and fostering regional connectivity in Ghana and beyond. Spanning a distance of 97.6 kilometers, this ambitious initiative entails the construction of a standard gauge railway line linking the port city of Tama to Mpakadan, a strategic junction in the country's transportation network. This project serves as the inaugural phase of a larger vision aimed at establishing a 1,000-kilometer railway corridor connecting Ghana to Burkina Faso. Once completed, this transnational railway line will extend from the port of Tama, Ghana's primary maritime gateway, to Ouagadougou, the capital city of Burkina Faso. By bridging the gap between coastal and inland regions, the project aims to revolutionize the movement of goods and people, facilitating seamless trade and commerce between Ghana and its landlocked neighbors in the Sahel region. At its core, the Tema Mapakadan Railway Project seeks to address logistical challenges and unlock economic opportunities for both Ghana and Burkina Faso. By providing a reliable and efficient transportation link, the railway corridor will enhance access to international markets, spur industrial development, and stimulate economic growth in the region. Moreover, by facilitating the transportation of goods to and from the Tima port, the project holds the potential to bolster Ghana's position as a regional trade hub and gateway to West Africa. 
As construction progresses on the Tema Mapakadan Railway project, it symbolizes a testament to Ghana's commitment to infrastructure development and regional integration. By fostering collaboration and partnership between neighboring countries, the project underscores the importance of cross-border connectivity in driving sustainable development and prosperity across the African continent. Two, the Katoka International Airport Expansion Project. It represents a monumental endeavor aimed at solidifying Ghana's position as a leading aviation hub in West Africa. With a vision to push the boundaries of African airport infrastructure evolution, Ghana is spearheading extensive renovations and expansion efforts at its main gateway, the Kotoka International Airport. Central to the project is the comprehensive rehabilitation of Terminal 2, a key component of the airport's modernization strategy. Additionally, the recently inaugurated Terminal 3 stands as a testament to Ghana's commitment to enhancing passenger experience and operational efficiency. These developments underscore Ghana's ambition to provide world-class facilities and services to travelers, airlines, and stakeholders alike. Moreover, the Kotoka International Airport Expansion Project includes plans to expand the airport's capacity to accommodate aircraft of various sizes, including the largest commercial airplanes in the world. By investing in infrastructure upgrades and runway enhancements, Ghana aims to attract more airlines, expand route networks, and increase passenger traffic, thereby stimulating economic growth and promoting tourism in the region. As construction progresses and the Kotoka International Airport undergoes transformational changes, it symbolizes Ghana's aspirations for progress, prosperity, and global competitiveness in the aviation sector. By positioning itself as a premier aviation gateway in West Africa, Ghana aims to capitalize on emerging opportunities in the rapidly growing air travel market, driving socio-economic development and enhancing connectivity within the region and beyond. 1. The Western Roller Line Project, it holds significant importance as a critical transportation route for minerals and bulk commodities in Ghana. Stretching from Takaradi to Kumasi, with a branch line extending from Dunkoa to Owasso, this railway network plays a pivotal role in facilitating the movement of goods and resources across the country. Recognizing the strategic significance of the Western Roller Line, the government of Ghana has adopted a systematic approach to its development, aligning with the overarching objectives outlined in the Railway Development Master Plan, RELU. This comprehensive strategy aims to modernize and expand Ghana's railway infrastructure, enhancing efficiency, reliability, and safety in transportation networks. The construction of the Western Roller Line is being spearheaded by Mrs. Amanda Holding Liliad, a reputable entity entrusted with the task of executing this vital infrastructure project. With funding secured from the government of Ghana through the Consolidated Fund, the project is poised to advance steadily towards its completion, underlining the nation's commitment to enhancing connectivity and fostering economic growth. As the Western Roller Line project progresses, it promises to unlock new opportunities for trade, commerce, and industrial development along its route. By providing a reliable and cost-effective means of transporting minerals and bulk commodities, the railway network contributes to driving economic diversification, job creation, and regional integration. Moreover, the modernization of the Western Roller Line aligns with Ghana's broader aspirations for sustainable development and infrastructure improvement. By investing in railway infrastructure, the government seeks to reduce road congestion, lower transportation costs, and promote environmentally friendly modes of cargo movement, contributing to the nation's efforts towards achieving its development goals. In conclusion, the Western Roller Line project represents a significant milestone in Ghana's railway development agenda, paving the way for enhanced connectivity, economic prosperity, and sustainable growth across the country. Thank you for watching this video to the end. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe. See you in the next video.